Hey everybody, Apex Comics. I received a letter from AMGMD Studios from Stratford, Connecticut. I'm here to open it, but I did have to pay some extra postage here, unfortunately. That's what the post office told me. It was $5 for this, uh, for three mini comics include postage. So you paid 70 cents. And the post office required me to pay an additional $3.10. So it's weird. He may have mailed it from his home office or something and miscalculated the postage. So I ended up paying like $8, which is, I um, wasn't too happy about that. So I wish he would actually adjust his uh, price rates or just straight up just charge me $8.10 for the whole thing. So... Might as well just be straightforward about it, right? So I'm gonna just go open this. Oh. Scissors, like like gray man's gonna be very proud of me opening it with scissors this time. So this was referred to me by Finrare Fire. I'll show you. Yeah, this is uh, this is my buddy Finrare Fire. This is his icon. He actually looks like this. <laughs> yeah, if I goes out in public just like this, so yeah. So I hope everyone, this my friend Fenrir Fire referred me to this. Exactly, the vault. So, so thank you for supporting independent uh, creators, which is good. His career is the vault. It says AaronGuzman.com. So you can actually go to his website. Check it out if you would. So I want to actually take a look at this. This is a very unique envelope. He actually just, it's very clever. I really like that. I don't understand why it's $3, though. It's it's an adequate weight. I guess the post office is losing so much damn money and want to charge people more. Damn them. Damn them, I say. <laughs> um, oh, crap. How do I... Well, I'm cut... I don't like cutting that much, but... Cutting and don't want to damage anything. Don't want to damage it. No, no, don't damage it. We'll get it neatly opens and inside. Oh. Wow, here you go. See, that's how you would package your mini comics. Has a little, looks like a little print. Mini comics 02, so I got. Vault, is it the vault number two? It's a mini comic bundle. It's clever how he packages it. It's a good idea. It's I'm very intrigued because I've made some mini comics in the past, back in 1988, probably before some of you guys were born. That's how old I am. Ah, yes, enough of my age. All right, here we go. Um, I don't want to struggle or anything about getting things out of a pocket. Or if you have to do with that. So, oh. Alright. Oh, this is like a little sleeve thing. That's pretty cool. October of 2020. Oh. It's fairly recently. It's a, it's a different, unique art style. There you go. Get green roses. When you have a hot date with justice, you should always bring a gift. Fishing trip. Land the big one or become dinner. Hourglass two of six. A mortally wounded soldier is turned over to science for experimental treatments. Well, damn it, I have to get issue one then. Better, better, better not be sold out of issue one, Aaron. Just telling you. <clears throat> Alright, there's the green roses. It's kind of cool. Huh? I'm thinking. You can do actually a 16 page comic with one sheet of paper if you want. That includes the cover. So you can have, you can have like, you know, 12 inside pages plus the inside back cover. And in the, the, the front cover itself, you have 16 pages, right? Inside back cover, which includes the story here. That would be like page one. This is actually pretty cool. I'm thinking, okay. Well, is this actually 16 pages? I'm gonna count the pages. All right, here we go. We got one, two, three, four, five, six. 
Uh, God damn. Why is it glued together? This is bullshit. Wait. Did he glue it? Seven, eight. It's like eight pages. So you get, what is it, an eight page story? So it's eight. I think it's like eight pages. Eight page signature. That's. Uh, that one. How the hell does he do it? It seems to glue it together. Like, two, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, look, seven pages in the story. Okay. And you get hourglass. It's probably like eight pages. It's not bad. It's, a, it's some decent work. I like how he has the black um, background on the whole thing. Yeah, he seems to have glued it for somehow. I don't know how he does that. What you could do, I've, I've seen my previous video of how to make uh, mini comics. God, it's like, like I made that close to two years ago. Well, look on my, my backlog of videos. I got several, but the one about mini comics creating, you know, I might have to do an updated one. But you can actually have more pages in this. You know, I've got like at least 30 pages for each book, Madame X and um, Nikolai Star. I did two of them back in 1998. I'll have to like go into the details. I did them in a larger size. I'm going to have to do one for you guys here. I just, you deserve it. So, all right. It's not bad. I'd say yeah, it's decent. Probably don't, I don't know if I'm going to order any more because... It's not enough pages. You could do... I mean, the art's good. There's some good art. I kind of like this. Fishing trip's cool. It looks kind of cool. The soldier looks pretty cool. I mean, yeah. You can tell this guy's... You know, I don't know how long he's been drawing, but... Um, it's pretty decent. It's kind of... It's got pretty cool style. Oh, Jason Alexander is the writing of this one. I wonder if there's different writers on each one. Yeah, so it's, he's the writing partner, Jason Alexander. You can reach him at uh, this web address. Is it fulgore.ak. What is that? Oh, e Fulgore Studio Studio. So damn small at gmail.com. And you have Aaron Guzman, M K Y W R A N C H at gmail.com. It's kind of tiny. Sorry about the tiny in this, guys. But how these guys produced it, so I'm not going to. I shouldn't apologize. Never apologize. All right, still the same. Yeah, writer. So Jason Alexander and Aaron Guzman. It's good to have a nice team up here. But guys, my request, if you're doing future mini-comics, put more pages in it. More pages for five bucks. I mean, yeah, you're getting eight pages for three. Well, three comics, eight pages, you know. That's, uh, I, I realize art takes time to do. I understand that. But uh, you might want to just up the price a little bit, maybe. That includes postage. Don't have anyone else pay an extra $3.10 for posts. It's ridiculous. Alright? Just saying. But yeah, that's, I like I like how it's packaged in the uh, envelope there. I don't mean to have a beef, but... <laughs> I kind of may have expected more. I may have expected too much. You know, my apologies. You know, I don't want to offend you guys. So, you know, if you want to, hey, order from these guys. If not, you know, it's your choice. Uh, I, I may order another one. Fuck, screw it. I'll, I do like support local creators. So I'll at least order the first issue if it's available. So I gave these guys a free plug. So you should thank me. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, here it is, actually. Here you go. It's Jason Alexander. Here we go. Fogbreakerstudios at gmail.com. 
And Aaron Guzman, illustrator. Okay, MKY, wrench, like monkey wrench, at gmail.com. There you go, guys. Who has a little symbol you can tap your phone into it and go to the their, uh, their emails addresses, I'm assuming. I guess. Don't. Yeah, they look like, they look like little, little code things. Oh, it says, thank you. Your support literally means the world to us. Well, you're welcome. I like to support local creators. It's important because um, it's a good thing in a way. I know this, uh, the coof is actually, is a bad thing. But it can be a good thing because people are actually buying more comics than they're reading. And I think it actually is, uh, uh, it's almost a lost art in a way. But in in many cases, I believe comics will survive. And that's why I'm doing this channel, to be to bring more awareness to, to comics. And <sighs> I've been a collector most of my life since I was seven years old. So there you go. All right, free plug. There you have it. Uh, there'll be more, I'm sure. Um, I've got, got more videos lined up. So stay tuned to Apex Comics. Please like, share, subscribe. Ring bell for notifications. Comments below, please. More comments, please. I'm not getting any, hardly any comments on my videos anymore. What's going on, guys? Don't be shy. Talk to me. Let me know. <laughs> All right. You guys have a wonderful and blessed day. Okay, and here you go. Uh, whoop, before I, I want to position it just right. Just right. There you go. Da 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 da. Ciao for now.